Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone's doing well and having an awesome day or night wherever you are. Okay, so um, it is November 2nd and um, first, I'm sorry, why did I say second? It's the first guys, I'm sorry. Um, I should have made this video yesterday, but I did not. And so I'm going to show you everything I got in the month of these, let's see, December. October, guys. Um, this is probably the biggest stack I've had in a really long time, like months. <laughs> so this is incredible. This is crazy. Um, got a lot of 4Ks this month, or last month, and there's supposed to be one particular title in this update, but it won't be in here until next month. And that's of course the Meg Two. Um, I ordered. My dad ordered it from eBay for me, so I was hoping to be here in this. In you know last month's update but it won't so um that'll be here in the next couple of days so yeah and you'll see it in the video guys of course but anyway so we're gonna do the dvds first and got a few dvds all from dollar tree and um a lot from like ebay um dollar tree mostly from that trip we took um, a couple weeks ago that's where a lot of these came from and a big box set which i'll explain in this video um got a lot of sub covers a lot of non-sub covers guys like i said a lot of 4k so um yeah and i'm actually using my microphone my ear my um earphones today because i need to get a microphone um but this one works just fine so um yeah ready to see what i got guys so so excited to show you let's go Okay, guys, so first one up, this one I got from Dollar Tree. Um, it's a four pack. So you got Juice, uh, Hustle and Flow, Juice, Tupac Resurrection, and Get Rich or Die Trying. I mean, four movies for $1.25 cannot beat that. Um, yeah, I, I have Juice on 4K, but I don't have any of the other ones. So I did watch all these, like, do like a movie marathon to watch all four of them. But um, so there's that, guys. There's the front. And the back. I need something to pin this up, like, right here. It'd be cool. So, there's the back of that, guys. So, yeah. Awesome. And then, I picked up on Chesil Beach. This one has Sroshi Ronin in it. This is, looks amazing. I like this. So, when I saw it at Adult, when I saw it at the Dollar Tree, I knew I had to pick it up. And, um, I love her. Lady Bird is one of my all-time favorite movies. One of my all-time favorite Lady, or A24 films. And, I could not wait to check it out. So, it's on Chesil Beach. Now, this one I found at, of course, Dollar Tree as well. Um, I've never seen this one before. Um, and like I said before, whenever I see Richard Gere films, I've got to pick them up. If I don't have them, of course. But um, we got Richard Gere and Wyatt Ryder, Autumn in New York. Never heard of it, but it actually sounds pretty good. And uh, from 2000, yeah, from 2000. So, cannot wait to check this out. So, yeah, there's Autumn in New York. And let me know, guys, is this sound, is, is the sound okay? Let me know, okay? Um, yeah. First time using it for my video, for my YouTube channel, so that's pretty cool. Alright, so final DVD, guys. Another Dollar Tree pickup, and that's La The Loud House, Absolute Madness, Volume, Season 2, Volume 2. I need to get all of these episodes. I love this show. Uh, one of my favorite shows on Nickelodeon, if not my favorite, because I don't really watch cartoons anymore except this. The older Loud House, I love. And Bob's Burgers. Rick and Morty, and the old Spongebob. Not the new stuff, the old stuff. And, of course, the older cartoons, too. But I love the Loud House, guys. So, there's that one. So, only, only, DVD, only DVDs I picked up. All right, let's go show this one box set here. Okay. Now, this one has a story behind it. I think I made a video talking about this. I think I did. If I did, I'll link it down below, guys. I think I talked about it. All right. So... I ordered Sleepy Hollow on 4K, which you'll see it in this video, finally. Um, I ordered Sleepy Hollow from eBay. Yeah, guys, I had to step away for just a second, but... I ordered Sleepy Hollow on 4K. Like I said, you'll see it in this video. Okay. I... This was, like I said, it was, it was weeks ago, right? Um, got my order in the mail. I was like, it's a big box. I'm like, okay... It has to be more than a, a movie in there, right? Because it's a big box for one movie. I'm like, this is weird. It's actually pretty heavy. 
I was like, okay, did he send me something else besides that? Or what is this? So I opened it up. And it wasn't Sleepy Hollow. It was this. The fly collection, guys. Okay, so I contacted the seller and I said, hey, uh, you sent me the fly collection instead of Sleepy Hollow. And he's like, oh my gosh, I'm so, so sorry. Um, you can either send it back to me or I can, you know, send it, send you the email or the address to the other seller and you can switch it. And I was like, I really don't want to do that. I'll just get my money back. So by the time I got the money back on all this, it was a debacle. Okay. I got my money back and I was like, won't you just let me send me the address of the guy or whoever it is and I'll send him this movie. Send me mine. He's like, well, I can't do that. I'm like, why not? He's like, we just can't do that. So I got this pretty much um, in place, Sleepy Hollow. So I just don't understand. But I got this. I've been wanting this for a while. So I pretty much got the better deal than the other than the other guy or girl, whoever ordered or got my Sleepy Hollow. And so I got the fly collection. <laughs> and I've seen them all. So this is nice. Nice set too from Screen Factory. Um, yeah. I've always wanted this one. I need to get the Omen. I need to get the Omen one. And there's another one. The Critters Collection. So I love this set. It's gorgeous. And um, yeah. So I got the fly, the fly Collection guys. So yeah. Love it. First one is classic. The remake with Jeff Goldblum is one of my all time favorite horror remakes. But the original one is one of my favorites. So yeah. The Fly Collection guys. Crazy story, right? Okay, so let's go and do the non-slips, right? I got a lot of those, all right? Okay, so yeah. a lot of these are like, like I said, from when we went to um, our town the other day, like the Dollar Trees, ton of Dollar Tree pickups from those, of course, Dollar Trees, duh. But, um, all right, first up, I've always seen the DVD of this one at the Dollar Tree with never the Blu-ray. So I picked it up. And I've never seen it. And that's Judy Blue and the Not Bummer Summer. Let me know if he's seen this one, guys. So this is from 2011. And it just sounds interesting. So, uh, yeah. Awesome. Alright. Where's the other? Oh, there it is. Okay. So I got the second one from Dollar General. And... Came home and ordered the first one. And I've, I got it a couple weeks ago, like a week ago. And that's Kick-Ass 1, or the first one, guys. I've never seen these all the way through. I know, that's really bad. But I cannot wait to check them out. So I got Kick-Ass. I know they're on 4K. Um, if I like them enough, I might upgrade. If not, just get the Blu-ray. Okay? And I got Kick-Ass 2. This one I got from Dollar Journal. You saw in that um, shopping video. I'll link it down below, guys. Um, so, I cannot wait to check these out. I'm going to like, probably do like a double feature night and watch both back to back. So, yeah. Kick ass too, guys. I like the covers of those. It's pretty cool. Alright, this one I got off. No, actually, this one is a really cool story, guys. I, I'll link that in a video down below as well. But Amazon has saw where uh, it was doing the Prime Day sale. Okay. My dad had ordered me some from the Prime Day sale. And... So, Amazon has saw it, and they said, uh, how many movies do you have? I also mean, you, you see it in the video, guys, but Amazon has sent me three movies off my wish list. Three! That's incredible. And I did watch this one a week ago, and this is a, this is a childhood classic right here for me. And that's, of course, The Land... Oh, if I can get it up. The Land Before, Before Time, the original movie. There's, like, 13 of these movies. It's ridiculous. Um, but I... I think I, I didn't really, re really remember a lot of this movie. I did see it when I was a kid. So it's been that long since I've seen this movie. But it's a cute movie. It's really cute. So, yeah. So there's A Land Before Time. The original movie. Thank you, Amazon, for sending me that. You're awesome. Okay. Then this is another Dollar Tree pickup. Act of Valor. I do have this on DVD. So now I need to get rid of the DVD because I got the Blu-ray. But I love anything about the military. So I cannot wait to check out this Act of Valor. Um... There's a lot of US, U.S. Navy SEALs in here, which is really cool. So, yeah, this Act of Valor. Alright, this one I got from Best Buy um, during, of course, Halloween time. Duh. Or spooky season, who will. And I know this is on 4K, 
But when I saw the Blu-ray, it had one copy left. It was like $6.99. I'm like, okay, I'm not passing that up. I love this movie. One of my all-time favorite werewolf movies, if not my favorite werewolf movie. That's, of course, an American werewolf, werewolf in London. Um, the only gripe I have, beh- I have behind this movie is the ending. I do not like the way they made him look. But other than that, I love it. It's one of my favorites. I've seen it two or three times now. Um, it is incredible. So, yeah, I need, cannot wait to revisit this one. So, there's an, an an American Werewolf in London. All right, this these next two are from what Amazon sent me from my wish list. Now, this one I didn't want to see. I wanted to get it when it first came out. And I never grabbed it. I don't know why. That's of course the kitchen. Cannot wait to check this out. I'm so excited. So, um, from 2019. So awesome, guys. The kitchen. Yeah, let me know if you've seen this one. Let me know um, your thoughts on that. They're my favorite actors. So yeah, can't go wrong there. Okay, this one I've had it on DVD. Um, I think I had I had it on DVD, but I think I got rid of it because it was like all messed up from like years of watching it. And I think I got it from, like a it was like a used DVD store, probably like movie gallery or something like that. But I've been wanting this one on deep Blu-ray for a long time, and when I saw it, I couldn't believe it. I was so excited to have this one. I love this movie so much. It's one of my favorite musicals of all time, and that's of course The Phantom of the Opera. I got introduced to this when I was in um, high school and uh, when I was in chorus class and because I took chorus for like a long time like elementary middle school high school and I love I got introduced to this in class and I fell in love with it and whenever I watched it I went and got the DVD of this movie and I watched it all the time and I need to watch it again it's been a long time since I've seen this movie but it's got a really young Patrick Wilson in here got Gerard Butler Emma Rossum one of my absolute favorite musicals it's just amazing I love the music in here um yeah I love Phantom of the Opera guys thank you Amazon once again all right this one I I got it at Dollar Tree I, I've never seen the Blu-ray there I think I, I think I'm well maybe I have one time I think I can't remember I've always seen the DVD at, at Dollar Tree so I picked up Take Me Home Tonight. I cannot wait to watch this. We'll be watching this one soon. Now the spooky season is over. I can start watching some of these movies. Um, but let me know if you've seen it, guys. What are your thoughts on it? Okay, guys. Let me know if you've seen Take Me Home Tonight. So, yeah. It just looks interesting. It looks funny. Okay, this one. Um, I've always seen the DVD. I've never seen the Blu-ray before at Dollar Tree. So, there's only one copy um we went out of town and it's worth a guilt trip with seth rogan and barbara streisand this one looks hilarious i love seth rogan so much um so cannot wait check, to check out guilt trip yes there's guilt trip all right this one i got the same day i got um an american werewolf in london and uh so, it also was $6.99 as well, so I figured I'd go and grab that. And it's one of my all-time favorite Universal Monster movies. That's a Creature from the Black Lagoon. Um, it's a classic. Of course it is. And I can see, I can watch this over and over and over and never get tired of it. It is an absolute must-have in your collection. And it's an awesome black and white film if you have not seen it. Um, it's incredible. Yeah, so there's an American, <laughs> a Creature from the Black Lagoon from the black lagoon okay this one i had it on dvd but i never found the blu-ray at, at dollar tree i don't think so um and i did enjoy it the first time i watched it so i want to upgrade the blu-ray that's don john written and directed by joseph gordon levitt of course it's got scarlett johansson julianne moore and of course Scar- <laughs> joseph gordon levitt in here it's pretty funny so there's don john Okay, this one I've never seen at the Dollar Tree on Blu-ray before. I don't think I've ever seen the DVD at the Dollar Tree. Um, now, I already have this movie with a subcover. But, or do, or do I? No, I got 16 candles with a subcover. Never mind. But this movie I absolutely adore. And I've never seen this edition at the Dollar Tree. I've seen it at the Big Lots, but I never got it before. That's, of course, The Breakfast Club. One of my all-time favorite 80s movies. One of my all-time favorite John Hughes films. It is absolutely it's a perfect movie. Perfect movie for me. Um, yeah, I love it. The Breakfast Club, guys. It's incredible. Okay, now I need to get the second one, but I finally, finally got this from Dollar Tree. It's a Spanish version, which is totally fine. And that's, of course, Escape Room, guys. Uh, I heard this one is really good. Her second one is not as good as the first one, but I still need to get it. 
Um, but I'm gonna watch this one at one point. So this escape room, I would turn around, but it's kind of all in Spanish. Well, I'll, I'll turn around anyway, guys. Um, in case you read Spanish. So, um, yeah, I like the cover of this one. So I need to try to sign a second one real cheap somewhere. Maybe eBay or something. I don't know. All right, this one I had the DVD, and I watched this one. Was it last year? I watched it, I think, and I had a fun time with it. So I want to get the Blu-ray, and that's of course 21 and over. I've never seen the Blu-ray at the Dollar Tree, so I figured I'll go and grab that. And um, so 21 and over. Make sure there's nothing on the back here. Okay, we're good. <laughs> 20, 21 and over, guys. Hold on. Okay, guys. Now, next one, I had to shift a little bit. That light's coming in that way, and it's, like, blinding me almost. Okay, this one I got at Dollar Tree the other day. I've never seen it there before. I've never heard of this movie, but um, it's a Shutter title. Or LJE Films Shutter title, I guess. Or Shutter, and it's a Bluebird in my heart. It just sounds pretty interesting. Um, I just saw the cover, and I'm like, okay, well, I don't own this movie. And I love a lot of the Shutter titles or IS even or R L J E film movies, so I figured I'd go and grab that. Um, so yeah, that's a bluebird in my heart. Okay, find a movie with a slipcover, guys. Um, they had, Amazon had this like hot deal sale going on the other day, and like some of their movies. And I saw this on there. I've always wanted to get both of these movies. It's a dull feature here. Um, it was regular fifty, and I got it for, or my dad got it for nine ninety nine. And that's, of course, The Land of the Lost and McGruber. I've been wanting to see these for a long time. And I heard McGruber is really good. And I haven't heard anything good from Land of the Lost. but Or haven't heard any good reviews on that movie. I'm still going to check it out at one point. So we got Land of the Lost. Is it The Land? Oh, it's just Land of the Lost and McGruber, guys. McGruber. Okay, so those are all my non-slips. Whew. Getting there, guys. Okay, we're getting there. I'm telling you, this is the, the biggest update I've had in a long time. Of course, I'm going to say the best for last. That's 4Ks. Okay, this one I already have, but I didn't have it with a slipcover. And I need to get the first one. Yeah, I need to get the first one, but I got um, Journey to the Mystery Mysterious Island. And I just had to get it with a slipcover. So, i never seen it. So, I'll get the first one before I watch this one, of course. But it's a Spanish version, which is totally fine. So, um, the final one slip is pretty cool. So... Yeah, there's the journey to or journey to mystery the mysterious island. Now, this next one I had it on DVD, and I think I'll still have the DVD. I think if I didn't get rid of it, but I found it with a subcover, and I want to give it another shot. And I kind of enjoyed it the first time I watched it. And that's of course the best of me with James Martin and my. Michelle Mononigan. It was actually pretty good when I watched it the first time, I think, last year. I think I watched it last year. And, um, yeah, so I want to get it with a slipcover. And I've never seen it with a slipcover. I've seen the blue over there many times, but never with a slip. So there's the best of me. Okay, these next ones I got from that, when we went to that out of town for a while. Now, this one, it came out, I think, last year. And I didn't want to get it right away because I didn't want to pay full price for it. But, Walmart had it in their dump bin for seven fifty. What a sub cover. I had to pick it up. And that's of course Paul's of Fury, guys. This one actually sounds pretty cute. Uh, it's got a really good cast in there. So I wanted to grab it for that. And just to find out what a subcover still is pretty cool. So there's Paul's of Fury, guys. Yeah, it just looks I might watch this tonight. Yeah, so there's Paul's of Fury. Oh, Paul's of Fury, the legend of Hank. So pretty cool. Okay, this this one I was so excited to find it with slipcover still. This was seven fifty at that Target over there in Aiken, South Carolina, which you'll see that video, guys. I'll link it down below. But just to find it with slipcover still is pretty cool, and that's of course Good Boys. I wanted to get this when they first came out, and I never grabbed it, and it's been since two thousand nineteen. So yeah, it's been that long since it came out. So um, cannot we check out Good Boys, guys? Yeah, let me know if you've seen it. I've heard pretty good things about it, so I heard it's pretty funny. So Good Boys. Okay, now this one, I had it on DVD, but I I thought it was pretty good the first time I saw it. I think I've I got the DVD somewhere. Then we'll get rid of it because i got the right now. But I found it with a subcover, and I've seen it before, but I never grabbed it. I've always seen this at Dollar or, um, Big Lots for like $4, but I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy it. It was only $1.25, and I can't wait to check it out again. So that's Masterminds, guys. Yeah, I picked it up finally with a slipcover. And, um, inspired by a ridiculous true story. 
So, yeah, there's Masterminds. They're four of my favorite actors in here, so Masterminds, guys. Okay, this one I got at Dollar Tree as well. Um, that's, I already had the movie on 3D, but I had the subcover. And that's, of course, Jack the Giant Slayer. This is a really awesome subcover. It's in Spanish, which is fine. So, this has got a nice glossy um, subcover. Pretty cool. So, there's Jack the Giant Slayer. Okay. Alright, got a few more to go, guys. We're getting 4K. It's okay. Now, this one I got at Target a couple weeks ago. My dad did. And, um, I didn't want to miss out on a subcover. It came out months ago, but I didn't want to pay a lot for it. It was like twenty something dollars when it first came out. Like, okay, I'm not buying that. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing that. Um, so Target knocked it down to fourteen ninety nine for subcover and I was like, Okay, I've got to grab this movie. And that's of course Renfield guys with of course Nicholas Cage and um Nicholas Holt, Aquafina and of course Nicholas Cage. Um I should have watched this during spooky season. I totally forgot to. I might watch this one tonight. We'll see what I watch. I don't know. But I got so many choices. <laughs> I really want to watch Barbie. But um so there's Renfield, guys. Yep. Renfield, that's so cool. So cool. Okay, this one, these next two, my dad got off uh, Amazon during their prom day sale. Um, so he picked up a prom trial for me. I love it. I need to get the other two. I haven't seen this in like forever. <laughs> so I grew up watching this as a kid and I loved it growing up. And um, yeah, two, that's, when did this come out? Yeah, 1990. So, um, I need to get the other two. But I love a on this one. This is one of those Mill Creek ones. I have a bunch of those Mill Creek ones as well. But I love this movie. Um, John Ritter is hilarious in here. So, we've got Problem Child. Now, this one, I didn't know it was mine. And he said, I got that for you. I'm like, what? I didn't know that. And um, that's, of course, Fear Guys. Or Mark Wahlberg. Mark Wahlberg and Reese Weatherspoon and I had no idea he got it for me. I had no idea. Um, so I've seen some, I've seen some of this like on TV whenever the entire movie, but yeah, so we got fear guys. One of, one of those Mill Creek slip covers and I was, and, and I was surprised as to what it slipped because it came out, I think months ago. And, um, so we got fear guys. Fear. Love it. All right. This next one I got from that target as well, which you'll see in that video. I'll explain everything about it, but this was seven fifty, and last one they had was slipcover. Had one more slip, one more not slipcover. Of course, I'm pick up the slipcover. Duh. Um, so I guess overboard, guys. This is a remake. I need to get the original one, but this is one that's roles are reversed. So, um, Anna Ferris, I love Anna Ferris. So can I always check out Overboard? I've seen some of the first one, but I've never seen the entire film. But I'll probably get that one first, and then watch that one, and then watch that one. So I don't really don't have to, but. I just do. All right, final one, guys, from Dollar Tree. Now, this one I didn't know. I first thought that was like a different movie because I already have a similar slipcover like this. So when I took it up, I picked it up and was like, "Oh, it's a different movie." And that's of course um, Endless Love. I have another one just like this with a different, like a similar slipcover. That's what kind of threw me off. It's got Hugh Grant in this, but this one's different. So um, yeah, but Endless Love, guys. Yep, I love the slip on that. It's pretty cool. Alright, let's move to my 4Ks, alright? Okay, I only got one without a cover, and it was just during the Prime Day sale. Um, my dad had ordered this one. I got it on Blu-ray. So, I might just put the Blu-rays up on this one. Um, I love this movie. One of my all-time favorite movies. One of my favorite action films of all time. And that's, of course, Mad Max Fury Road, guys. I love and adore this movie. It's so good. Um, yeah, so, Mad Max Fury Road. Okay, guys, so they're moving in that light. It's coming through those blondes. I'm like, oh. All right, so Mad Max Fury Road is amazing. I love it. And I knew, I watched it on 4K, but it's been a while since I've seen this movie on 4K. And it's been a while since I've seen this movie, period. So, uh, but I love Mad Max Fury Road. Yeah, I need to get the other ones on 4K. So, this Mad Max Fury Road, guys. Okay, now this one I got off eBay real cheap. Like, real cheap. <laughs> So, it was used, which is totally fine. I don't care. But, I did watch it. I thought it was pretty good. It wasn't, like, my favorite Disney Pixar film. But, it was still pretty good. And, uh, this, of course, Elemental. This is the Walmart exclusive lenticular. Um, yeah, the only way you get this on 4K is from the Walmart exclusive. But, I know you can get it from Disney Movie Club. But, the only way you can get it on 4K without being in the Disney Movie Club is at Walmart. So, 
Um, that sun secular is absolutely incredible. So, um, yeah. Oh, they, they did have a still book. That's right. But, um, I love this in particular. But, uh, I'm gonna watch it again one day. I thought it was pretty good. So, it's elemental. Okay, of course, my dad got me Sleepy Hollow on 4K. Now, this, this, a problem with this subcover, like, I, everywhere I went, I could never find a mint subcover. There's always issues with it, and I was like, what is going on? And that's, of course, Sleepy Hollow, guys. I, I think, I'll, I don't think I saw one person get, like, a mint subcover. And we watched this one during spooky season. And I thought it looked, it looked really good on 4K. Um, it looked really, really good. They cleaned it up real nice. The dark scenes were really nice and crisp. But um, this is one of my favorite Tim Burton films of all time. I love Sleepy Hollow so much. And to have it on 4, um, 4K finally in my collection, yes. So, Sleepy Hollow, guys. Yep, Sleepy Hollow. Right, let's move it a little closer. Okay, then we got Scream 3. So, all we need now is Scream 4. have all of them on 4K. But this is one of my least favorite screen films. The fourth one is my least favorite. I cannot stand the fourth one that, at all. But um, hopefully we get it on 4K. I have all of them. But Scream 2 is easily my favorite uh, screen film of all time. And I did do a top 10 um, horror films. I'll link that down below as well to you guys. If you have not seen that. Um, but I just, I'm just glad to have it with all the other ones. But um, yeah. I'm going to watch it again one day. Maybe my, maybe my mind might change. I don't know. But um this is a, I can watch it, okay? And I didn't ever want to watch the fourth one again. So, um, yeah. Screen 3, guys. I like how they all kind of, they all match on the side, which is really nice, too. All right, next up, my dad got the same, oh, I got that from eBay, guys. I'm sorry, I got that from eBay. All right, next up, I my dad got me this during the Prime Day sale. Ooh, during the Prime Day sale. And I was... Two things. I was nervous that it wasn't going to come, that it wasn't gonna come with a slipcover. And if it did, was the slipcover going to be mint? And because this one came out, it was $22 at Target. Or probably get it anywhere, I guess. But it was like $23 at Target, $24. I don't know. But um, my dad got it for $15.99 during the Prime Day sale. And this one occurs pretty much mint. And of course, Teenage Mutant, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the remake. I enjoyed this movie when the first time I saw it years ago. And, um,. Yeah, I loved it. I can't wait to check out the 4K. I need to get the second one. My dad has the second one. Um, but, yeah, I don't think I've ever seen the second one. I don't think. So, probably not. So, this, I like the silver cover on that. It's gorgeous. So, yeah. Alright, next up. I got these next two from Best Buy. When they were doing their spooky season Halloween movies. So they had a little cardboard set up. And they're both nine ninety nine. Okay. Now, we, I watched this one uh, when we first got it a couple days after. And I think I've seen it before, but I don't remember watching it as a kid. But we watched it the other night, and uh, or like a week ago, two weeks ago. And I've never seen it. I don't remember ever seeing that movie. Because I did, nothing rang a bell when I was watching the movie. So and that's, of course, it's The Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown. Um, this was non 99 What a subcover. Incredible. Um, because the subcover is out of print, which is crazy. Because I got this one, uh, with a subcover, and it's a great, it's a Charlie Brown Christmas, yeah. And I got that during Christmas, like, a couple years ago from Best Buy for, like, 15 bucks. And that subcover is out of print, too, so. But, just to have this one, it's pretty cool. I need to get all the other ones on Blu-ray or 4K, but it, it, it's amazing. So, there's, it's the great pumpkin, Charlie Brown. It's just a cute movie. The problem is they're not long enough for me. Anyway, all right, next up, I got, I got the same day when I got that It's a Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Now, I already had this on Blu-ray, but um, when it first came out, I didn't get it right away. I didn't get it at all. But during Black Friday last year, they had the Blu-ray for $7.99. I was like, okay, I'll just get the Blu-ray because I got the other three on Blu-ray, or other two on Blu-ray. And I was like, dang, I regret not getting the 4K of that. But... Gladly, or surprisingly, they had this for $10 as well. That's, of course, The Conjuring 3, The Devil Made Me Do It. I should have bought this <laughs> when it first came out, but I got the Blu-ray, like I said, and this is, like, my least favorite Conjuring film. It's kind of, eh. But maybe one day I might, down the line, I might watch it again. But the second one, or the first one is my favorite. The second one's really good, too. Um, but just have a little cover. So I hope one day we down the line we get the other two on 4K. It'd be great. Um, so, 
Yeah, whenever the Nun comes up, we cannot wait to get the Nun on 4K. I didn't get the first one on 4K. I got it on Blu-ray. But, um, you know, I don't really care for the movie. But have all the Conjuring... And then we need to put all the Conjuring movies on 4K. And all the Conjuring universe... I know the Nun is. And, of course, this one. Uh, put them all on 4K. Like, all the Annabelle movies as well, too. So, but I love the stuff on this one. So, that's Conjuring, The Devil Made Me Do It. So, The Conjuring 3, The Devil Made Me Do It. Okay, we got three more to go, guys, and we are done. All right. Now, this one came out a couple weeks ago, and when I went to the store that day, that Tuesday, I didn't know you. I didn't even know this was even coming out, because uh, I got a few other things besides this one. Um, I think it's the same day when I got that Charlie Brown. Um, I think it's the same day I got that Charlie Brown and The Conjuring. I think so. I think, but. I went to Target, and I saw it there. I'm like, okay, I've got to pick it up. I've got to pick it up. I heard really good things about it. I love A24. So, I had to pick up the 4K. Of course, I've said that so many times. That's, of course, ooh, talk to me, guys, on 4K. I've heard really good things about this one. I cannot wait to watch this one. I should have watched it during spooky season, but I just never got around to watching it because we watched other movies instead. But I'll be watching this one soon. I promise you guys. I promise to be watching this one soon. Um, I've heard nothing but great things about this one, so. Oh, that's a sticker on there. Hold on, guys, hold on. Alright, so, here's the front, guys. Just back. Yeah, cannot wait to check it out. So, this talk to me, guys. Okay, this one was a huge surprise find for me. Now, uh, this is why I like going to these different stores. Uh, these different, like, states and different cities. Because there's other different, you know, Targets and Walmarts that have, have other different types of movies. Especially some movies that's been out for a long time that still have subcovers. And so many subcovers are out of print. So that's why I like buying them. And this one's out of print. And when I saw it at that Target in Aiken. You just, you'll see it in the video, guys. I snagged it like that. Snagged it up. And I, I even though I did hear this movie wasn't great. But I wanted to have it. And that's, of course, the new Mutants, guys. Yeah. On 4K with a slip. And I looked at it when I was there. This one goes to like $60, $70 or something like that. And I got it for like, I don't know. I, I paid a little bit for it. I didn't pay that much for this movie. But to have it is pretty freaking cool. So I snagged it. Yeah, so there's the New Mutants on 4K. I love a slip cover on that, slip cover on that one. Okay, final movie in this update. I think I saved the best for last. Yeah, this movie I was talking about, this movie I was talking about earlier that I wanted to watch. That's, of course, Barbie. <laughs> so, I got this on release day at Target. Because Best Buy, my Best Buy didn't have any copies at all. Which is typical of my Best Buy. But, um, yeah, I had to pick it up that same day. And, uh, cannot wait to check it out. So excited to watch this one, guys. Be watching this one, hopefully, tonight. So, yeah. So, cover is definitely gorgeous on this one. Oh, my God, I love it. So, there's Barbie. We got Barbie. We got the New Mutants. We got Talk to Me. A twenty four. The Conjuring Three. The Devil Made Me Do It. It's a Great Pumpkin. Charlie Brown. The Oh Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. The remake from two thousand and fourteen, I believe. Yeah, two thousand fourteen. We got Scream Three. Sleepy Hollow. Elemental, the Walmart exclusive lenticular, subcover, or edition, Mag Max Fury Road. Don't feature of Land of the Lost and McGruber. McGruber. Uh, a Bluebird and My Heart. 21 and over. Hold on, guys. I'm trying to get these. Okay, here we go. We got Escape Room. The Breakfast Club, Don John, Creature from the Black Lagoon. Oh, this one also includes um, the 3D and 2D versions as well, if you're interested. Got Guilt Trip, or The Guilt Trip, sorry. Take Me Home Tonight, The Phantom of the Opera, The Kitchen, An, Amer an American Werewolf in London, Act of Valor, the Land Before Time. Okay. Kick Ass. Kick Ass 2. Oh, I love the cover of that, guys. It's pretty freaking cool. Judy Moody in the Not So Bummer Summer. 
we got the fly collection. Okay. Um, we got Endless Love. A Reward Remake. Fear. Problem Child. We got Renfield. Jack the Giant Slayer. Yeah. We got Masterminds. Good Boys. Pause the Fury, The Legend of Hank, The Best of Me, Journey to the Mysterious Island, The Mysterious Island, awesome. All right, and we got the DVDs, guys. We got The Loud House, The Loud House, Absolute Madness, Season 2, Volume 2, Autumn in New York, On Chesco Beach, Final Movie, guys. This is four pack. Four Urban Rap Star movie collection, Hustle and Flow, Juice, Tupac Resurrection, and Get Rich or Die Trying. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, all my takeouts for the month of September. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. No, October. It is November. October, guys. So, like I said, biggest haul I've had in a really long time. And I've already got two movies for the month of November already. Um, well, really one. One was supposed to be, you know, last month, but it won't be here until this month, uh, which you'll see it in the video. Um, I don't want to ruin it for you guys. But, um, and I am looking at Blue Beetle as well, because that came out yesterday. I am looking at that, see if I get a good price on it. So, I, I got to pick it up anyway, because it's DC, and plus is that part of that 100 year story thing. I'll get all those. Um, that's the reason I got the last movie I just talked about earlier, because it's part of that line as well. But, uh, you probably already know it. I probably, probably just told you what it is, but... Um, I was going to get it, but if you weren't for that subcover, I got to get it. If it wasn't for the subcover, I probably wouldn't have picked it up. But since it's part of the 100 year, I got to get it. So, uh, yeah, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, a much longer update because I got so many movies. Um, and let me know, do you like me sitting right here in front of my other shelf right here? Let me know, guys, because you never really get to see this. This is pretty much my 4K shelf pretty much now. I love it. And uh about to add some more 4Ks to it. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Make sure to like this video, get a thumbs up, big old thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Uh, make sure to comment down below. Think about pickups. What did you get from the month of October? I'd love to know, guys. I'd love to know what you got from the month of October. Anything awesome? And recommend, if you want to recommend me to, can I talk today? Recommend me some horror films. I would love to have, I need to add more horror to my collection. I got a few. Uh, I need to get a lot more because I love horror movies so much. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Make sure to subscribe to my channel and uh, share this video around if you would, guys. Always hit that little notification bell right down there so you won't miss out on a video. And, um, yeah, I guess I will talk to you guys later. Bye, guys. Bye.